Good morning from National Weather Service Pocatello. This is your weather hazard briefing for Sunday, July 31st. Our key points for today, it's going to be a hot and dry day. We do have a heat advisory in effect from noon through 9 p.m. for portions of the region. We're expecting widespread highs in the upper 90s with some locations reaching triple digits. And the heat concerns will also continue into tomorrow. And then monsoonal moisture arrives tomorrow as well. We'll have showers and thunderstorms beginning, and uh, there'll be widespread chances for those tomorrow through late Tuesday. We do have less confidence in the coverage and extent of those beginning about midweek. And we'll have a return of cooler temperatures beginning Tuesday through the rest of next week. And those temperatures will be normal to slightly below normal with highs in the 70s to upper 80s. Here's a current look at satellite imagery. As you can see, clear skies above. Uh, we will have scattered to broken clouds filling in beginning about mid-afternoon. Our weather risk outlook. Like I said, we do have that heat advisory for the Snake Plain, Magic Valley, and portions of the southeastern highlands, as well as the Wood River area um, today beginning at noon through 9 p.m and those heat risk concerns will continue um, into tomorrow with high temperatures looking pretty similar to today for tomorrow as well. Um, the Idaho Department of Environmental Quality does have the air quality advisory for Lemhi County going through at least um, around 3 p.m. tomorrow. And beginning tomorrow, we will see widespread chances for showers and thunderstorms across the region persisting through late Tuesday and then Wednesday forward we do have less confidence in the extent and coverage of those storms and showers like I mentioned models are struggling a little bit to come to a consensus on timing and strength of features um, so we'll continue to fine-tune that in the days ahead but we are expecting uh, breezy conditions as well beginning Tuesday. Just to show a visual of the heat advisory that we do have in effect, um, it's going to go through 9 p.m. tonight. Here is a fire and smoke map. We do have um, arrows pointing to our two largest fires in the region right now, Moose Fire and Wood Tick Fire, along with their current acreage. And you can see the smoke plumes mapped out here as well. Air quality is remaining in the good to moderate range. Um, there is that air quality advisory in effect, like I said, for Lemhi County through afternoon tomorrow. Um, moderate air quality can start to be a problem for um, sensitive groups, members of sensitive groups. Our high temperatures for today, we're looking at widespread upper 90s um, in the further west we go, especially in the eastern Magic Valley, we're looking at triple digits. Temperatures for tomorrow. Lows tomorrow will be mostly the, in the upper 50s to lower 60s, um, but highs are going to look very similar to today, so we do have heat concerns persisting through tomorrow. Humidity levels. Uh, most locations will be at 15% or less minimum humidity for today, but tomorrow we will start to see an increase in humidity levels. And this heat graphic here, these are just some important reminders to help to alleviate and avoid heat illnesses. Um, just some precautions to take when you're outside, either working or doing outdoor recreation. Be sure to seek out shade when possible, stay hydrated, um, seek out AC when possible, and be sure to check on those that don't have AC and members of more um, of the vulnerable populations. And be sure to double check your vehicles, never leave pets or kids unattended um, in the car. And climate prediction centers, current six to 10 day temperature and precip outlooks. We're looking at near normal temperatures and um, a little bit of an increase in the precip outlook. Uh, we're looking at a little bit more for slightly above normal. And just to summarize, today will be dry and hot. We do have the heat advisory beginning at noon through 9 p.m. for portions of our region. We'll have widespread highs in the upper 90s with some locations reaching triple digits. 
temperatures, high temperatures that is, are going to look pretty similar tomorrow. So those heat risk concerns will continue for tomorrow. And we'll have monsoonal moisture arriving tomorrow with widespread showers and thunderstorms uh, Monday through Tuesday. We do have less confidence in the coverage of those uh, beginning about midweek. And we'll have a return of cooler temperatures Tuesday through the rest of the week with normal to slightly below normal highs um, in the 70s to upper 80s. Thank you for listening. As always, if you have any questions or comments, don't hesitate to email us or call us. Check us out on weather.gov and hope you have a wonderful day.